How many times in life you felt that you can't make it and things just disappoint you over and over again? Life is tough with ongoing problems with people dying left and right. Life is tough and every minute counts. Every minute that you think of doing right may turn wrong. And our failures just stand in front of us. Many a times you do feel that there's nothing but a brick end to your life. That there's nothing that life can offer you. But yet, sometimes we wait for that tunnel, that light at the end of tunnel, that light that can shine us through. And in that light, we find a lot of solace, a lot of comfort, our definition of who we are, and that will never change. And sometimes they do say that when you die, you have exactly seven seconds when everything replays, when everything you've done wrong or good or in your childhood, it comes back. And it gives you those haunting memories of who you were. They say you change with time. They say you will never change. They say that whatever good or bad you've done, it reflects. But we can't really change the past, can we? We cannot decide who we've become in the near future, but we can decide what is happening in the present. A lot of people want to leave marks of who they are and what they will become. A lot of people want to distinguish themselves from the brutal past and move on. Sometimes the past stays with you in nightmares, in forms of dreams, recurring. And sometimes you're stuck. You don't know where to get out. And the best solution for this kind of phase of life is to keep breathing, keep believing. And sometimes you're in the break point of not believing. Even if you want to believe, you can't. You will just stop, keep on moving on and on. Your face changes, your thoughts change. You regret every moment in your life that you've done wrong. Many people don't. Some people do not know how to grieve. Some people do not know how to Think about what happened was their fault. Some people do not know how to have sorrow in their lives. But this is how it is. This is how life is with the whole situation going on. Life doesn't always give you lemons to make lemonades. For some people around you, you may think that life has given them too much. And for you, yourself, Life is a bit challenging. You have to struggle, come up with good grades, like I did, like I suffered. To keep up with the challenges, sometimes I forgot myself. And many times we do mistakes that will haunt us for the rest of our lives. And you can't really change that. You can't really become who they want you to be. You have things you wanted so much, better grades, better life decisions, climbing upstairs, you make mistakes, like I did. And you can't really change that. You can't really reverse the thing that you have. All you do is get older, fatter, uglier, or prettier. But the same thing that you had in your 20s, you can get in your 30s. The same thing that you have in your 20s, you can get when you were a teenager. And if you make that mistake of being so horrible as a teenager or in your early 20s, you regret it for the rest of your life. But that's how unfair a system is, or life is. You, are, you do not get a second chance of redoing or becoming a better person, going back in time, making better decisions, and then you end up here, alive, thinking, now I'm here, 
with the burden of good and bad and now there's nothing that I can do can't build it all over again can't take our take care of our health health and lives and ourselves this is how it is so think back what you've done wrong but don't let the back pull you to that extent that you do not want to live anymore be positive be thoughtful and if sometimes in life you think that there's no way out talk to somebody make friends that counts make opportunities that counts make something of yourself that you feel you've never done before i know your body ages you're not the same person anymore your thought process has become more irritated more irritable more resilient sometimes but more stubborn to be honest and that is a time when you realize in life that do not give up there are a lot of people your age who've lost so many opportunities and you're lucky enough to have them to have your parents alive to have people alive you to have still survived like we all did in 2020 those who are watching we survived 2020 and we survived the catastrophe that had us overwhelmed we're still here at the end of the tunnel with people who are meant to be with us at the end of this year another justification that we can provide to us ourselves is that maybe you did something good to to others maybe you did something amazing and that amazing thing is keeping us joyful keeping us here keeping us sane and they say when you decide to stay sane there's a time when you decide to take the life in your under your own hands and your own control and as you know life is tough to all those who have bereaved to all those who have lost someone close to them you know lord we all did and to those who believe that life has to offer such so much more keep believing because you never know that you have to lose in life although it's supposed to be a positive video with my serious concern this the last message for 2020 you're not alone through all your punishments through all the gains through all the rewards through all your happiness and joyful moments you're not alone but to those who think they are everyone has somebody like them in this world who's suffering just like them maybe more maybe less you're not alone everyone has their regrets everyone has their happiness everyone has their remorse all you can do is join hands and make a better future love things change and putting your thoughts your body your face it's different so is mine there's nothing we can do but all we can do is to pray and become a better person every year every end of the year and more years to come when there's no more hope is left in me